Major General Shikongo, flanked by members of the Special Reserve Force, the Emergency Response and the K-9 unit of the police, visited Rehoboth to do house-to-house searches and monitor the adherence of COVID-19 regulations. Rehoboth, he says, is emerging as a town that does not adhere to the COVID-19 measures, while criminal activities, especially dealing in drugs, is rife at the town. Shikongo therefore warned members of the force with ill intent to refrain from compromising police operations. Those in Rio boat or anywhere that are communicating the criminals, telling their friends, you are on a system. Right? We are on a system, we are monitoring you. We want Rio to have an effective operation and this is what we are going to do. Be police officers, be honest to, our, to yourself, be honest with the organization. True to the Deputy Inspector General's word, at the back of this house, the sniffer dog smoked out 28 bags of dacha. Where do you buy it? Where do you come and supply him? Supply him? You know, you know him way. I don't know him very well. But how, how do you get it? You go to Venduk or do they bring for you? You go to Venduk. You said you don't know very well. You know the house in Venduk? The 18-year-old suspect, though, says he does not reside here, but claimed that the drugs belong to him. The NBC understands that the owner of the house was arrested last week Friday and asked this gentleman to look after the house. But this suspect exonerates the house sitter and remains adamant that the drugs are his. Both young men were arrested and charges will be laid. Day. We must send a very clear and a strong message to the criminals that Namibian police will not dis- fold it his arm. The next stop was at these houses known as hotspots for dealing in drugs. But time spent at the first house has cost the police dearly. Word reached the suspected dealers. Some have locked their property and left, while at other houses the police found nothing. While on patrol, the law enforcement officials also came across this bar, which was found to be in violation of COVID-19 health protocols. We just came hello, to hello, listen to me. Yes, but this yes, noise of keeping on a selling on a Sunday, you people around here, you are just operating on a, on a Sunday. General, we just came to buy Kapana. Where is my Kapana? Is... The police made three arrests at Rehoboth, the third being this man suspected of selling alcohol on Sunday. The suspect, however, maintained that all the liquor in his fridge was bought in celebration of Father's Day. Some Rehoboth residents who spoke to NBC of camera applauded the police for the operation. Emil Sebeb, NBC News, Rehoboth.